I was reading in 2 Thessalonians moments ago, Paul was very thankful for the faith. Now these are the first believers, the first who believed his glorious gospel. These are the first ones. And he's so thankful for their faith. In other words, their ability to see things before they actually exist. Faith is not only a noun, it's a verb that requires action based upon our belief sustained by confidence. That is not an original with me. I steal stuff from others. This was a very, very um, gifted Bible teacher who would say that. But the faith was flourishing. It was manifesting. It was impacting others. They were believing God for supernatural involvement in their daily walk, which as a result produced love for each other that was growing, spreading like a raging forest fire, or in our case here in Southern California, more like a spreading brush fire, no doubt. And as I read this passage, I thought, we absolutely have to model these Thessalonians. Paul also mentioned their endurance under great persecution. Now, currently, we don't know much here where I stand about a lot of persecution, not like the churches in Iran, Iraq, Syria, Lebanon, Afghanistan, Tajikistan, China. But they didn't quit they stayed in the fight as this is written the author of one who fought the good fight stayed the course and looked forward to the crown that would be rewarded to him when he sees jesus face to face and i couldn't help but think this should resonate with every follower of jesus christ in 2020 Christ in us, the hope of glory. God bless you.